so what are we doing today i'm going to show all the lipsticks and lip glosses that i love to use and like just talk about the ones that i bought over the years um and while we're doing that we're going to talk about negative energy and why it's so bad to have negative people around so let's begin in november of last year 2023 we're in 2024 now I moved from living at a place while I was trying to finish doing my degree. When I moved in, the lady, she was nice, but I feel like because people watch too much news and like sometimes people are just like suffering and like they're angry, so they project that onto other people. So then it got really bad with her. So then I moved and where I moved, there was someone that lives right here she moved now um and it's like upon entry it's like as soon as i moved here my girl just decided that she didn't like me and i'm just like a happy joyful person but then i come across people that are negative and they do affect me because it's like there's nothing that i would do to anyone like nobody that would make them feel like they have to treat me a certain way you know what i mean like i speak my mind and if we have a problem we can talk about it but I'm always like, I'm sensitive, so I treat people in a sensitive manner. Where it's like, if we don't have that type of relationship, I'm not going to come at you and say certain things. But anyways, uh, yeah, the girl that was living here, she since moved and took her negative energy with her. And this is why I'm able to just like be great again and do the things that i love to do which is like just sit here and make create content i'm trying to blow this up but it's not really working out we'll see maybe it'll get done later i love green tea specifically if you wanted to invite me over for tea but anyways, it's not good to be around negative people. Like, she used to constantly, like, sometimes listen to my conversations because her room is right next to mine. And, like, if she heard me going out, probably she thought I was going to go to use the washroom. She would come out and, like, walk in front of me, just making a fool of herself. Because at the end of the day, I feel like I've always been a type of person to be protected by God. You know, so, like, when you try to do wrong to me, you're going to have a bad day. Or something's gonna happen to you that's gonna like make you remember what it is that you did because you don't need to be doing that so yeah and that's the reason why I keep to myself most of the time like I don't really mix and mingle with too much people because I don't have the time don't want to have the time especially females i am always around like a guy because it's like you're a guy i'm a girl we're totally different and we can get along but females women you really have to pick who especially me who to be around anyways enough of that let's get into the lipsticks that i use and the lip glosses that i said i was going to talk about so my absolute favorite would be this lip injection by Too Faced. I also use Too Faced mascara a lot. It's the only mascara that I use. I don't use fat big lashes and it's because it's so woo, just nice and pink. Feels really great on the lips and lasts a very long time. Like very long. So all the wonderful beautiful girls who like to go out and just you know put on some lip gloss and conquer the day i recommend this one another of my absolute favorite is lip salvation oh shit the light really messes up everything okay you can see it now um and this is how much i love this lip gloss and there's like probably 
at least five more in like a jacket or a bag somewhere the only thing about these ones is they dry very quickly so it's like you have to constantly reapply them but look how it makes your lip look see that like instantly nice pink and rosy so this one would be my favorite like no doubt it's just that it doesn't last as long as the one that i showed you first another one that i love is this lip oil by skin i don't know what it's saying in the bottom but you can see it there you go um what do i love about this maybe how it sounds but it's really juicy i don't use these ones a lot i have three of them i got it on amazon in a pack you kind of have to double dip but i guess i like the packaging and how thick it is because i like thick things but this is like a great buy too and it does last on the lip for quite some time lip smackers these are flavored so that's really why i like them it's like sometimes i'm just like like if i'm at home i'll just grab one i have another pack this is the second pack and i'll just like put it on i love these because of, because they're flavored this looks bad but i remember in 2017 kylie um she put out uh she used to have like a lot of collections that she put out i don't really follow her and buy any of her stuff anymore because after i bought this from her i was like i thought it was so bad quality that i swore i mean look at that it's even hideous i yeah i don't like her collections i personally feel like because they have like a big name they don't put like a lot of work into creating quality stuff maybe they're clothes but definitely not that line that i bought from i used to also buy a lot of stuff from colourpop this is from colourpop this is like a a matte lip as you can see it's really pigmented and I'm gonna do like a video of how to like make sure your lipstick is on properly but this is just to show you and it dries up I wear this a lot sometimes if I'm going to like a dinner or something but I definitely clear it clean it up really well I use baby oil to take it off but I can't find my baby oil right now this is Mac lipstick this is like my favorite color from them I don't think I want to put it on because we're running out of time. I'll just put it on. You watch how it just glides on my lips. Very pretty. I wear this a lot. And easy to come off. <sighs> My back. I need a massage. This I would wear like so much. It's called Natural Beauty by Sally Hansen. Let's see. Like it's and it's flavored too. I really like this one this is one of my favorites also forever stay moisture gloss it does forever stay and last but not least this she glam gloss that i got from shine machine i really like it i like the head like it has a nice puffy head and it lasts long so i'm definitely gonna buy this again in this color and those are my favorites comment if you use any and let me know which one's your favorite